Are you thinking about going for a new thermal paste and you've been thinking about this Corsair TM30 paste? Well, we're going to test it today and see if it is performance like it says on the box and how it compares against others on the market. Okay, let's start off with the test system. We're running an Intel i7 12700K processor. The motherboard is an MSI Z690A Pro motherboard with DDR5 memory. We're also running 4800 MHz RAM and the graphics card is a GeForce 3070 and we've got a Lexar NM800 SSD. All testing was done on the same machine, disconnected from the internet, running only the basic programs we needed for the testing, running the same versions, everything was exactly the same. Thermal placed was applied the same on every single test, so we spread it completely over the CPU. And the cooler of choice was the Arctic Freezer 34 eSports Duo, which is basically a dual fan cooler. So down to testing. So this test we did three times at 30 minutes each time and we got the average and with the Corsair we actually did the tests again just to confirm the actual results because they were so different than most of the others on the market or at least the ones I thought it would be competing against. Don't get me wrong it's not an expensive um, paste in the world but uh, in comparison to something like the Arctic MX-6 or even the older MX-4 it doesn't perform very well to be honest with you considering the prices aren't that much different. I was actually quite disappointed with the Corsair TM30. I thought with a name like Corsair behind it the performance would be pretty good don't get me wrong they do have other pastes on the market which hopefully perform better but this one specifically it's called performance paste but when it comes in at seven degrees behind for example the arctic mx6 and the noctua h2 then well i wouldn't call that performance by any means to be honest with you especially when it's sort of uh, actually worse than for, for example the acasa t5 pro grade and nearly as bad as the Acasa Essential paste, well, at least it wasn't as bad as the StarTech paste we tested, but again, 7 degrees difference between that and the leaders of the pack, uh, it's definitely not the best in the world to be honest with you, and I'm actually quite surprised uh, with the outcome. I hope you enjoyed this video and know I did. Why not check out one of our other videos by clicking this box up here, or this one just down here. Otherwise, you can give us a thumbs up, like, subscribe, comment below, let us know what you think, and we'll see you next time.